Hi guys, and welcome back to another art video, and I'm going to do the 10 minute art challenge for this video, and I'm just going to get straight into it because I don't have too much much to say about it. But basically, the art supplies that I, I already have my art supplies picked out, and I'm going to try to make a art thing in 10 minutes. Um, I'll show, I, I'll quickly give you a run through of my art supplies. I have this uh, Strathmore watercolor paper. It's a, just a piece that I cut a long time ago and I had it laying around so I thought I would use that. And then the supplies I'm going to be using for coloring, I'm going to be using the Winsor & Newton Cotman watercolor sketchers set. I have a set of 12. Um, you'll have seen me use them in my last video and that was my first time using them. And this is going to be my second time on a real piece on my channel. <laughs> And uh, the brush I'm going to be using is the Pentel Aquash brush. I have the three. I have three different sizes, and this is the large for sketching. This purple color erase pencil that I picked up. I picked up a pack of twelve, and I just decided to use purple for this challenge. I don't really know why. Um, for inking, the Pentel pocket brush pen. And for highlights, if I have time for them, or if the watercolor is dry, I have the Uniball Signo white gel pen. Okay, so that's about it. Those are all the supplies I have picked out. I don't have anything planned out <laughs> um, picture-wise. I just have um, a general idea of how I want to go about drawing. And that's pretty much it. I don't have anything planned out, so it could be a total disaster. But I think I draw pretty fast, so I don't... I hope it won't be too bad. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started now. So that's, yeah, that's what I'm doing now. <laughs> okay, so I have a timer here on my phone. Um, and I'm going to set it for 10 minutes. I'll just zoom in a little bit so you guys can see more clearly. <laughs> and I'm going to start the timer and then I'll begin drawing. So there we go. It started. Okay, so I'm just going to start with a circle. It's probably going to be a bust because that's what I mostly draw. <laughs> I'm just going to start with a circle and the basic like face shapes. I normally draw a circle in the middle of the nose first. In the middle to do a nose with. And then I go for the eyes. I'm just going to do generic eyes. I'm just going to go whatever first comes to mind because I don't have a plan. And i got to get this done as fast as possible so I can get done with <laughs> so I can get to doing the other parts of the picture. I don't want to take too long on sketching. Uh, eyebrows. And then I do some kind of fancy lip things. Normally my lips are pretty big because I draw uh, females and I don't know, females wear lipstick. Guys can wear lipstick if they want to. I don't know. Um, yeah, but normally my lips are big <coughs> just because small lips are hard to draw and they always look awkward. Then I'll do ears. I should start doing the face shape before I um, do anything else because that would probably that would probably be a smart thing to do <laughs> because it'll help my faces look more face like. Okay, for hair, um, I normally struggle having ideas for hair. I'm just gonna do a generic fringe thing. Uh, I'll do some curly hair. Just curly hair is easy to do with watercolor. Just gotta block in some color. Ah, uh, I already lost three minutes, almost! Ah, uh, okay. Um, yes. Now I'll do a neck. Okay, and then... Uh, just a generic shirt. I'll do uh, the sleeves in a darker color than the rest of the shirt. Okay, so that's my sketch. I'll just go ahead and fix some of that up. And then I gotta start inking. <laughs> okay. I don't have much to say for this. I might, uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't have much to say, so if I'm silent, that's why. I normally ink the eyebrows even though they're under the hair because I feel like eyebrows are an, an important part of the expression and it's not real life, so I can make it look however I want it to look. That's one thing I didn't think about. You have to be slow when you're inking with a brush pen on watercolor paper or it will get that grainy texture. Uh, but I'm not worried about that right now. <laughs> I'll just leave it. I don't really 
doesn't really bug me too much. I'm just gonna do the eyes black because watercolor takes a while to dry. So if I made the eyes colored, it would take a while for them to dry so I couldn't add the little highlights to them like I usually do. Um, then I just do like a little circle, like a little kind of squishy thing like that. The ears. I don't know. I don't have anything to talk about for this. I should have prepared something to say. Oh well. Uh, yeah. <laughs> just pretty unprepared for this whole challenge. Uh, okay. So now I'm done inking. Uh, I have six minutes left to do watercolor. I'll just do black sleeves. In hindsight, it would have been a more interesting picture if she had colored sleeves. But that's not what I'm doing right now. I'm doing the art challenge. I'm not trying to make a good uh, picture. Okay, I might have to wait like 10 seconds for this to dry. Oh god. Okay, the sleeves are definitely not dry, but I'll just stay away from those for a little bit. I'll start coloring. I gotta go fast. Uh, okay. Oh god, I don't have any skin tone mix. Oh, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> I might just give her a dark skin tone so I don't have to mix uh, a whole bunch of yellows and reds into it. Um, that's still not a natural looking skin tone. Ah! <laughs> okay. Oh dang, I'm gonna run out of time real quick. Okay, I'm just gonna go for it. It's super orange looking. Okay, she can just be like um, uh, from an island and just have a really nice tan. She, remind, she kind of reminds me of Lilo's mom from Lilo and Stitch right now. That's a really bad <laughs> skin tone. It's like just orange, basically. I will try to fix it. I don't know if I really can at this point. Oh god. I'm about to go into pure panic mode. I have like five minutes left. Yeah! Okay. Um, normally, I add a little red and just let it, uh, like flow around how it will for the blush on the cheeks and I usually do a little bit on the nose and normally I would add highlights there but I don't think I'll have time this time. Uh, I don't know what color her hair should be. I don't have a black which would probably be the most natural color to have for this skin tone. Like the most natural color hair for somebody of this skin tone but I don't have a black and I cannot afford uh, the time that it would take to mix it up. So I'm probably just gonna do blue hair. Because why not? Blue hair's fun. Everybody likes the blue hair. I guess I'll mention <laughs> I'm live streaming while I'm doing this. So, yeah. I don't have the chat open, so I'm not really talking about it, but I don't know. Just an interesting fact to mention. It's a pretty important part <laughs> of the video, I guess. Or this not really that important. I'm gonna stop rambling. It's really hot in this room. Probably because I'm super nervous. For the most part because I'm super nervous. Uh, I have a few minutes left. <clears throat> After I finish the hair, I will probably have a few minutes left so I might add some kind of background, abstract background or something. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I. I guess I'm kind of congested right now, just summer allergies, so I'm sorry about any sniffling or coughing that happens. God, it's really hot in here, I had to turn off my air conditioner so the sound quality wouldn't suffer. Plus I'm super nervous, so yeah, I'm gonna die, basically is what I'm trying to say. Everybody come to my funeral. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna add for a background. I need to do her lips. That's what I'll do really quickly. Just have some bright red lipstick. Ah, no! It's seeping. This is what I didn't want to happen. Okay, it's like seeping into... I don't know. I think I might just leave her shirt white for now. Oh god, I have two minutes left. Ah, panic, panic, panic. <laughs> uh, I might, yeah, I might leave her shirt white because I feel like baseball shirts are normally... Like, that's kind of what I'm going for with that. I feel like baseball shirts are normally just white with colored sleeves, or in this case, uh, black sleeves. I'm gonna do some 
flower details in the background. Ugh, okay, I think I can relax now. I'm just gonna do some flower details in the background. Because uh, <laughs> I have two minutes left and all I'm doing is flowers. For the most part, the piece is done. So kind of stressful though, because it doesn't look that great. Oh god, oh god, everything's bleeding into each other here. Ah, uh, fix it, fix it, fix it. I should have gone for something more ambitious. I feel like this might be a boring video. I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe I should have done something crazier. Oh well. It, as I said, I did not have a plan for this, so. Whatever. Ah, okay, one minute left. Okay. Yeah, I feel like I'm not gonna run out of time to do anything I want to do. Uh, I wish I... I should have gotten a hair dryer and just like started blow drying in the middle of the <laughs> video so I could add my highlights to the hair, but alas. I know what I'll do! Okay, I have one minute left. I'll use this white ink to try... I don't know if this will work. Okay. I'll use this white ink to try to add highlights to the hair. Oh god. Or try to add some kind of lighting, shading stuff. Oh Jesus, this was a bad decision to do so late. Okay, ah, uh, okay, uh, just adding some white ink, adding some white ink. Oh dang, oh dang, I'm gonna die. <laughs> uh, I have to add eye high highlights to the eyes. Um, I had a highlight to the nose, it'll seep everywhere, but I'm not really worried <laughs> right now. Um, I liked how the way the white looks in the hair. Ah! Okay, uh, yeah, I think that looks good. I think it looks good. It looks good to me, so I'll do it. And, uh, I have some blue on my brush, so I'll add some blue to the background so we can get a nice primary thing going on. 16 seconds left! <laughs> uh, mm, do some circles. Circle. 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 Five seconds! Uh, okay! No! Ah! No! It all bled! No! <laughs> okay, I don't know if this counts as cheating, but I'm gonna add my signature after the piece is done. Oh, I don't think I'm allowed to touch it after, but all the blue bled into the skin. <laughs> I want to fix it, but I don't, I think that's against the rules. That would definitely be against the rules to fix it now. Okay, <laughs> so this is my uh, 10 minute art challenge. It kind of went terribly wrong at the end. It, it was going well for a second. Um, the highlights in the hair don't look that great. Just a bunch of white blobs now. Uh, but yeah, I feel like I did it okay in an okay amount of time. I feel like this is adequate for 10 minutes. Um, the blue bled into the skin, which was not good. But yeah, this is supposed to be a fun, simple, like, challenge video anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, do the thing that you do when you like a video, that would be nice if you did that, and yeah, that's basically all I have for this video, so I'm gonna stop now before I ramble on about nothing. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!